Hi everybody, I am Cookie Doll and welcome back to another episode of our Victoria 3. Let's play as Russia, where we are at the moment trying to pass public schools. Uh, we are at about 50% chance of success, but because uh, the Orthodox Church is quite against it or they want to keep religious schooling, they are a little bit uh, hindering our process, making the stall chance at 31%. But we'll hopefully be able to get going. Uh, while I'm on pause, uh, I did switch a few of these uh, production methods to electric engines because we did get um, electrified rails uh, in some spots. So I am going to see how this does with my... Uh, a power like for example here Minsk I'm sure this is a bit of an issue here oh and I did also queue up a few uh, power plants as well I think a couple of them are yeah on top here like Minsk uh, Saratov uh, and Kiev are on top just to get them in there quickly and we have a bunch of other industries on the way as well of course, uh, yeah, I don't think I have, yeah, this is the issue, you don't have, any... well, you do, you just don't have any, um... yeah, I'll just leave you as is, that's fine, Rosk, you're good. Uh, ooh, is this Mexico or Italy? Italy wants an alliance. Uh, hmm. Who are you hating, Italy? An alliance with these guys for some reason. I feel like nobody's really going to mess with Italy. How about these guys here? Tuscany. Do have a trade agreement with these guys? Yeah. I might want to have an alliance with Italy. They're somewhat decent. You know what? Why not? Italy, let's go ahead and have an alliance. We'll see what happens with that. Uh, okay. Uh... Aqualens, did I change you as well? I did. For some reason I did change you. You're the one that also doesn't have much of that. You know what? I will change you back to just our, your regular steam engines. That should be A-OK. -okay. Yeah. We'll keep you at steam engines. Uh, Brazil wants a trade agreement. You know what? Why not? I'll we'll get a trade agreement with Brazil. Uh... Lithuania, you need some power. Let's get you maybe to some coal. I think that should be pretty good as well. Yeah, because I think I switched you to do this. Yes, we're good. Why is this... How is there input goods shortage? There's no input goods shortage for you now. Ah, uh, you don't have any people. That's your issue. So let's get you rotary valve here. Paper mill, also rotary valve for you. Shipyard can't do anything for that. Let's get you refrigerated rail cars. Yeah, that should be pretty good. Let's get you harvesters. We'll get you electrified fences and refrigerator rail cars. I think that should be all pretty good. It should allow you to hire some more people, including these guys here. Uh, furniture, we can also go to rotary valve. Yes, let's go, please. Uh, a matter of business. Suspicious gentlemen have been reported charging an extra fee. Okay, yeah, yeah. This is the extra fee thing. Uh, 
You just get loyalists in general. Uh, raising concern. Actually, you know what? I think I do want to have... Yeah, my military. Let's go ahead and do that. And, of course, there's a stall. Why wouldn't there be a stall? Uh, yeah, we'll get the enactment success chance. And matter of business... And more loyalists. Yeah, let's go ahead and do more loyalists. Uh, okay, before we go much longer, we do have a pretty good uh, armed forces now giving us bonus to attack and defense. Uh, I think it might be time to annex uh, Finland. I know there's uh, 10 years left. Nine and a half, I guess, at this point here. Uh, but I think going after Finland is pretty good good still um, yeah let's go ahead and do that why not they will obviously not accept but let's confirm so let's annex Finland uh, I promised uh, whoever the commenter was on one of my videos that we will be doing that so you know what why not let's go ahead and annex Finland I think that should be a-okay uh, what were we doing yes we we're doing some more stuff here Armenia yeah Latvia you I think if you go to coal fire should be pretty good but let's get you another one of these in here and you might benefit from having some less workers in certain places okay, let's get you the rotary valve that should be pretty good yeah let's get you some rotary in there as well yeah food industry yeah you'll definitely hire that's good uh, steel mill let's get you rotary as well I think you should be able to hire some low. Oh, the Netherlands. The Netherlands. Uh, okay, and we got automatic bottle blowers, which is pretty good. Uh, alrighty, so... The Netherlands wants a piece. Uh, I mean... I don't think we need to worry about the Netherlands. The only thing is, do I want anything from the Netherlands? I do. How much would that be? If I go add war goal, uh... Conquer state. Dutch Niger Delta, Dutch North Cameroon. 3.6. And this is 11.4. Are you kidding me? Dutch Congo. Where's Dutch Mauritania? Oh, this... I don't know where Mauritania is. Yeah, I can definitely get these two here. And maybe Northern Cameroon. Uh, you know what? Let's do that. So, Dutch Northern Cameroon. We'll grab you. So I will mobilize this guy here to come onto this front so we can do that that's fantastic and I most likely will also get some other things in there just I can't add the primary okay that's fine so yeah the Dutch Congo and Dutch Gabon
Okay. This is all groovy. And let's get these guys here out. You are escorting convoys. Get you to go in here. The thing is, these guys have been so reliant on me. I don't think they'll be able to do anything against me, to be honest. Uh, so, Conquer States, Dutch Congo. Okay, we did advance here. Uh... Yeah, let's get 14%. That's fine. Oh, almost thought we were, uh, we we're a little too far gone here. And... Gabon, right? Boom. Let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Yeah, the Dutch... You guys will uh, be sorry about that. And you know what? I will, just for good measure, I will go ahead and get another one of these guys mobilized. Just so we can kind of run through them as quickly as possible. Uh, yeah, you don't really have anything for this that I want to do. Uh, I don't care about Man of Wars. Could build more of these. Actually, are we doing... No, we're doing mechanized farming first. Then combustion engine. Okay, so combustion engine is after this. Uh, that is fine. Yeah, this is going to be good. The mechanized slaughterhouses will be actually great for us. Because we will need that indeed. Yeah, these guys are coming, but a little too late. Yeah, we got siege artillery. Uh, the picture here is tripping out a little bit. Are we low on anything? Okay, some artillery might be a little bit cheaper than we could do. So if we go down to artillery... Oops, that's small arms. Never mind. Uh, and artillery... We are losing using still just smooth bore. Let's go breach load and see what that does for us. Probably gets it way too cheap. That's fine. Okay, you are going down here. That's fantastic. That's great. Uh, how are we doing here? Yeah. I don't think these guys will be able to stop us. Not when we attack with like three people. Why are we attacking with like three? Like this here, we're attacking great. Okay, here we're attacking good as well. The Dutch are defending here. Okay, yeah, Finland won't be very long for this world. And there we go. And all the African holdings are being sieged down as well. Beautiful, fantastic. Okay, I think I do like this. Uh, what are we doing here? Tomsk. Uh, anything I can do for you, Tomsk? Yeah, you're an electric engines. Wait a minute, we can get you to coal-fired plants. Please do that right away. It's fine. Build these two as well. And... I think you could benefit from some... Uh, 
automation here like steam donkeys uh, rail transport would be pretty good as well and then we'll just leave you at that for the moment being okay uh, glass again we could do automatic bottle blowers but let's not do actually have quite lots of oil but let's leave it at that for now uh, these guys here I wonder if they're gonna make it back but we'll see what happens here I think we might actually win this war before anything else happens uh, spending a penny members of the gantry assembly have explicitly stated that installing public restrooms in the exhibition will harm its good order and reputation uh, in good order and reputation will be worse if we don't install them that's I think very true Lollipops in Moscow become 20% of them actually become more loyalists, which is great. Yeah, and I don't really care about the gantry assembly anymore as is. So let's go ahead and do this. Yeah, we we'll spent some more money, but I think the loyalists will come in quite handy. Uh, how is our government doing anyways? Uh, if you reform government, uh, we could get the petite bourgeoisie in. Petite bourgeoisie, any... Okay, law enactment, that's good. A matter of business, suspicious... Okay, yeah, yeah, this is all good. Let's just get this. Uh, actually, elected bureaucrats might be pretty good I might want to do that so but let's wait for a second let's wait till this war is all done and over with yeah cuz you guys will most definitely uh, lose in no time okay I think we're doing pretty well here. Uh, what are we missing? Okay, some ironclads. We could use some more ironclads. Uh, if that is the case, I can go to... Yeah, I really don't care about the man of war, so we'll do that. Really don't care about the man of wars. But I wouldn't mind maybe building another one or two of those. Uh, let's do it like so. Uh, art still... Okay, some hardwood. Giggity. Uh, let's get some more hardwood going in here. I feel like... Well, the thing is, I don't want to switch all of them at once. Okay, I think we have actually have almost everything doing hardwood. Not quite. Pretty much all caught up on hardwood that's good indeed uh, what else is on the queue sugar a little bit radios yeah the regular stuff oh yeah I can go ahead and switch 
to uh, mechanized slaughterhouses. So we'll use electricity actually, but let's go ahead and do literally everything to mechanize this. And maybe not intensive wool gathering. Let's not maybe do that. Uh, what did that do to this here? Okay, submarine. we got some submarines as well. That wouldn't be a bad thing. Okay. Okay, there we go. Yeah, we're definitely beating them up here. Yeah, almost. No, Dutch are being a bit of a pain in the butt. Hmm. There you go. Finland is done, which we now own Finland. I am wondering... I hope you guys aren't going anywhere. No, you're not. I am wondering if getting a naval invasion... Really, why are you all of a sudden getting pissed off? We should be able to pass the law next turn around, I hope, at least. Uh, but we'll see what that is going to be like. Uh, you know what, let's go ahead and try to actually navally invade the Dutch just to get this war over with a little quicker. You know, they do have all of their troops here. Or it might actually be better. Uh, so mobilize, uh, land naval invasion of here and We'll select the fleet, which is this one here. We'll select this fleet. Confirm. Uh, you could use a another admiral, but I will just promote you. So that should be pretty good. We could actually do another institution here. Home affairs, yeah, I think the penalties for turmoil, because I do have some states with some turmoil indeed. So let's go ahead and do that. Well, for payments, I don't know, but let's go ahead and do this. And let's see if we will be able to... actually invade in there really this one to advance are you kidding me uh, let's do this because I do want some more pop attraction for the intelligentsia that should be pretty good and we're already at 88% that should be pretty decent uh, well, yeah, let's go ahead and do this. 13 more months until we get our exhibition. Yeah, I think we should be pretty good here. Yeah, we don't need you, so you just go ahead and chill there. All right. How are we doing here? Uh, we're doing pretty well. Yeah, you guys, I don't care. It's one of my subjects is needing men of war, so I don't really care about you. Uh, radios. Just need more radios, which I think we will need more and more no matter what. So, getting some more of these would be good, or just in general having more let's go 
Where do you... Alrighty. So now... Uh... Kursk, Kiev, and then where is what's happening here? Northern Caucasus? Really, eh? Okay, we'll see what happens there. Uh, and I'll get five in Moscow as well. There we go. We'll go ahead and do you a few of those. I thought that we were all doing steel. Oh no, these guys are still doing. Uh, so yeah, steel hulls, please. Just do it and team ships to just do it. Don't care anymore. Uh, yeah, let's do this. Political strength is always good to lower that on those. Uh, the government has received requests for from North Caucasus to provide translations of some official documents to their language. Um, five years, you know what? Ooh, that's... Jeez, I did not notice. Okay, I did not notice 10% of my uh, bureaucracy is going to get me into a negative that much. But that is what it is, unfortunately. Oh, and there we go. You do want to do it. Boom. Perfect. Okay. There we go. And Africa looking a little cleaner now. We still have this little tiny bit of the Dutch in there. Uh, but that should be a-okay, I think. Looking nice and clean. Okay. Alright, I, I think we're doing pretty well. We don't have a lot of time left here. Uh, what do these guys want? Okay, what do these guys... What kind of weird... You want this little piece of land for Gabon. I mean, you guys are crazy. Especially because I got some land from them now. No, because I'll be taking this land for free anyways. Ah, uh, these guys don't know what's going to hit them. Alright, well, the thing is, that's one of the options. We can do some more warring against Britain. Uh, what I'm kind of thinking is getting these two provinces from uh, the Qing so that we can, uh, there is an achievement here for uh, Central Asia stuff, so I wouldn't mind doing uh, that. Uh, but we'll see what we can do. And we are 100 million ahead in GDP of the British Empire, and then the French Republic has just fallen. Hardcore. And Tunis. Ugh. Tunis number two, I want to uh, reiterate, and technically Morocco, uh, <laughs> but are you allied to anyone? Not really, you have a bunch of truces. Uh, yeah, let's get the political strength down. Uh, and let's see if this is going to happen here in December. I think after that I will put a cut in there. Uh, what is happening in Austria? We got Austrian aristocratic revolt. Okay. Seems fun. Okay, we got Confederation of the Rhine, which is kind of cool. Okay. 
Yeah. This is all pretty cool. Uh, anybody else want to maybe come into my... No, it doesn't look like it. Do you guys want to come? No, you have a trade agreement with me, but they already have somebody in there. Uh, what's it called? Uh, not sure of influence, but in their market, so they wouldn't want to come into mine. Uh, Oman, no. No, nobody wants to do any of that. Ooh, what is this? Uh, yeah, let's do this. Why not? Let's do this. And we got public schooling. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. I love it. So this should make these guys even less powerful as is. And plus get more of uh, literacy out and about so hopefully we will be able to do anything with that but this session here will have to wait until next time so for now thanks a lot for coming and watching another episode and i will catch you next time bye bye